we wanted to tell a story with the Bohem project that is dedicated to health workers. And when something bad happens in the world, whether it's a war, whether it's a pandemic, those people sacrifice so much. And what happened to us during our lifetime pandemic in 2020 with coronavirus really put a spotlight on the sacrifice that health workers made for humanity. The reason we chose to do three productions of La Boheme in 2024 is that it's basically three pandemics, three centuries, and one story. We started in the winter of 2024 with the 19th century production of the traditional La Boheme, where tuberculosis was the pandemic that devastates the world. We are continuing in the fall with the double header. Rent, we tell the same story, but this time it's in the 20th century, and it's HIV that is killing everybody. And then we fast forward with an updated version of La Boheme, which we're doing in 2020, in the 21st century, and it tells the story of the coronavirus pandemic and the impact that it had on artists during the 21st century. There's something about Pullman Yards that is absolutely unexpected. It's the pre-show. It's before you're actually getting into the main space. There's something eclectic and not operatic about it. And I think that is what's going to connect an art form that is 400 years old with the audience of today. <laughs>